Details about that attacker who stabbed a police officer at an airport in Michigan on Wednesday. The FBI is now investigating it as a possible act of terrorism, and that suspect is in custody. ABC's Alex Perez is on the scene for us there in Flint with new reporting. Good morning, Alex. Hey, good morning, Robin. Authorities say the suspect cased the terminal here for about 45 minutes, coming up this escalator and then stopping at a uh, restaurant and then at a bathroom before attacking the officer who was standing right here. This morning, federal authorities digging into Amor Fatuhi's past as they search for answers after that attack on Lieutenant Jeff Neville at the Bishop International Airport in Flint, Michigan. The FBI saying they are investigating it as a possible act of terrorism. When the subject went up to the officer and stabbed him, he con continued to exclaim Allah and he made a statement something to the effect of you have killed people in Syria, Iraq and Afghanistan and we are all going to die. About 9.45 a.m. Wednesday, the calls to 911 start streaming in. I got an officer down there for the stabbing. Authorities say the suspect exited an airport bathroom with a 12-inch Amazon jungle survivor knife, similar to this one, and allegedly ambushed Lieutenant Neville from behind, stabbing him in the neck and back. And there was a whole bunch of blood everywhere. Blood was everywhere, and it, it was crazy. Some nearby as the horrifying attack unfolded, jumping in to help the officer. I helped him knock him down, and I put my foot in his ankle and the other one and hold it down. Passengers and airport employees evacuated. Bomb sniffing dogs scouring the airport, which was completely shut down for some seven hours. The suspect is Canadian and due in court on Wednesday. If convicted, he faces up to 20 years behind bars.